yellow bell pepper, spicy herb, salty herb, and then go to the rock slide. So I think that's near station two, I think. Creative mode, yellow bell pepper, salty, spicy. This should work. This should be the combo that I need for electric sparkling and encounter. Not as good as my wasabi and noodle sandwich that I made to give myself the sparkling power yesterday, but this one's supposed to be more effective. Which is a shame. Nice. Sparkling power, tidal power, and counter power. Now we pack up and go. I think, like, each time I go down the rock slide, I should glide in case one spawns, like, on one of those ledges. That'd be a disaster if a shiny spawned there and I couldn't get to it. That would suck. Yep, yeah, they're definitely showing up now. Iron Thorns are surprisingly chill creatures. Like, those are dudes that I would have expected, like, all of them would just instantly want to charge straight at you. But, it's not been my experience with them, at least. I'm going to zoom out for this, because, I mean, there are just so many. Imagine if I found a shiny Raichu, I would cry. There's so many robo tyranitars. Yeah, wow, the the whole encounter power thing kind of busted. I I must say. I also love the music in Area Zero. Oh god. Really? Really, Tyranitar? Good old Mecha Godzilla. True. <laughs> this is hilarious how many of them there are. Like, usually, usually when you have no boost, it's like one. Now it's like it, you're in just an ocean of Tyranitar. So this is the true power of salt. I'm curious as to how a sandwich can cause this. But... You know, I'm not gonna question it right now. <laughs> it wasn't even a good sandwich. I know, right? How much time do I have left? 20 minutes still, okay. 100% will be on the other side of the fence and fall off. That would be the biggest tragedy in Pokemon history. While I would be incredibly upset, that would probably be the single funniest shiny fail ever. And like, I, I couldn't even be that upset if that happened. You're not shiny, right? No, that's just the lighting. Are you? Nope. Also, these guys are a lot smaller than I expected they would be. Average size of a T-Tar is 6'7". That feels small for that thing. But... Oh! That's it! That's it! Oh my god! Oh, don't you dare run away. Don't you dare run away. Get over here. Get over here! 
Let's go! Shiny Iron Thorns. That is sick! In the quick ball! Critical catch! Let's go, Shiny Iron Thorns! Oh, that is so cool! <laughs> oh my god, let's go! First shiny Paradox Pokemon. Well, 52 Iron Thorns in the critical catch. It's Jolly. I don't actually know if that would be great on Iron Thorns, but... Oh, hey. <laughs> it's another one. Not shiny, though. Oh my god, let's go. And now we save. Wow, I was not expecting that to be that quick. Okay. There it is. Wow, that is that looks so slick. Alright, uh, how much time do we have left? 15 and a half minutes? That was in less than half the boost. Whoa, buddies. Chill. Chill. You're just turned off. Yes, you are. Alright. We got the one. We got the one electric friend. Now... I'm gonna jump off this cliff. We're in the iron hand zone now. Alright, I've gotta keep my eyes sharp. This one's not as obvious. It should still be fairly obvious. 